Welcome to Bar 10 Ranch. Today, we're going to be doing some limb cutting. Uh, we've got an 18-wheeler coming to pick up cattle on Thursday. So, this tree right here needs trimmed. Um, I'm going to have to cut this branch right here. It goes all the way up and over. And I'm going to have to limb it out. Um, I'm going to teach you guys how to safely do that without equipment. I'm not going to use... Um, a bucket truck or anything uh, and then I've got a dead one right here that while I'm cutting stuff might as well cut it out got a dead one right here gotta cut that guy and it's right over the fence they're the dogs my helpers for the day and then I got one extra helper I'm not sure if I'll have to move him or not but yeah we kind of like him he's okay uh, it's just a rat snake He's not venomous and kind of like keeping him around because it teaches Declan about snakes in a safe manner. He's not venomous. Um, I have handled him before. He's, he's a good snake to have around. Okay, so change of plans. Um, since my sister-in-law's car is in the way, uh, my, my brother-in-law, her husband, saw me up here with the ladder getting ready and I've got this tied off right here Let's see if I get to the yeah tied off right there and the way I've got it set up is it goes over this limb up to a higher branch over there so it's gonna it's gonna twist twist this and pull it that way and land over there is what I was trying to do. Going to cut it off up there, tie the ladder up there. But instead, I said I wasn't going to do it with equipment, um, and it was basically because I didn't have another person here to help me. But he saw me doing this and decided I need help so I don't mess up his wife's car. Plus, I don't want to pay for damages. Uh, nobody does. So. Don't try this at home. We are using equipment now. Last year, we broke a guy's arm, wrist. I don't know. He had a broke bone after doing this. Um, don't try this at home. This is not how I usually do it, but this will save me time. Okay, so I'll have some ruts I need to fix in the yard. That's no big deal. Small price to pay for this getting done. Quick, open this up. 18 wheelers should be able to pass through here, no problem. Um, did not hit the car, or if I did, I didn't damage it. Let's go check over here. Um, yeah, we're good. Yeah, there's a couple of little leaf marks on the windshield a little something right there it is a scratch but I can buff that out I may have to wash her car for her. 
But that will come after. I need to take care of this now. Um, cut the little limbs off and buck up, which that's the terminology for cut these in sections. Now, a little tip I like to do is I use, let's go over here, I use still saws. Um, this one right here is my lemon saw. It's a small saw, but <clears throat> you've got your bar, however long it is. And what you can do is you can take a tape measure and you measure from there to wherever. If you want these 18 inch, 16 inch, whatever, make a mark with a Sharpie. It does eventually wear off. Um, I know 18 inches is about here. Um, 16's the bar. So, and I believe this is an 18 inch bar. Uh, 16 inch bar. It's a 16 inch bar. So, 16 inch bar, 18's, you know, a couple inches here. I like to cut them all the same length. So when you stack them, it looks nice and neat. Um, but that's just me. Okay, so I have it all limbed out. All the limbs are off these big, <coughs> big branches. They're ready to be bucked up into smaller pieces for firewood. I'm gonna go dump this. I'll be right back. Okay, so the old man came by. Said he cut that limb off. Well, the ladder won't reach it, so I gotta use the truck. Um, yeah, if you thought the other idea was a bad idea, don't try this at home. Don't tell OSHA. Okay, so the camera fell over and it it messed up, but I was able to get it on the phone. I got the limb like there. Uh, it didn't knock the ladder out from underneath me like I thought it could have. Now all I have to do is lower it down. Okay, so I have it all bucked up. Now, what I do, it's a pain in the butt to wrap your arms around these things, pick them up. These are ice tongs. You just put it on, and boom. Pick it up, one-handed. I'm gonna get these all loaded up. All right, these are all the bucked up logs. I'm gonna go stack them. They'll dry for a while and then they'll be split. Big helpers here. And he bought, brought back up 